Hey everyone, Burbank51 here with another free indie game. Last two weeks I introduced you to two very punishing games. The first was Transdimensional Hell Spider, the experimental shmup by dungeon crawl creator Linley. The second was Challenge from Kyoshi, the parody slash tribute of the so-called worst game ever made. This week we're playing what, judging by his name, is probably the most punishing game of all. Punishment 2, The Punishing, is a tedious platformer with a, well, uh, <laughs> punishing twist. On the surface, it is a pretty straightforward game. You must climb a tower filled with obstacles, making sure to flip every switch on each floor to access the next. To make it a little more aggravating, the controls are made incredibly sensitive and the player character goes flying at the very implication of a key press. And to make matters worse, he apparently has ice soap glued to the bottom of his shoes, so he's definitely difficult to control in an environment that demands perfection. Despite its name, I think Punishment 2 is much less a torture and much more a zen-like experience. The graphics have a unique and clean minimalistic style that combine with the repetitive percussion music to create an almost artful aesthetic. Mark Essen is well known for his unique and well-designed games, and Punishment 2 is not the least of them. It even has multiplayer for your split-screen gaming needs. Oh yeah, and there is one more thing. Every time you reach a new level, all the switches reset and you must go back down to the very bottom floor and do everything all over again. Well, anyway guys, have fun with that. It's a free game. Download links will be in the description, and I'll see you guys next time.